Developing news now on another disturbing child abuse investigation. Pawtucket police say a 13-year-old burned a 2-year-old relative with a cigarette lighter. Tonight, that teenage boy is facing criminal charges. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell joins us now live with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom. Susan, we don't know how the two-year-old and 13-year-old are related, but we do know they don't live in the same house. Police tell us the two-year-old was burned when the 13-year-old and two adults were babysitting him. Pawtucket police are investigating an alleged case of child abuse that happened at a home on Grand Avenue late last month. We've learned a two-year-old suffered serious burns to several parts of his body. Police tell Eyewitness News the little boy was burned repeatedly with a cigarette lighter. They were burns to the neck, arm area, and groin area. Uh, I'm not sure if they're permanent injuries. I'm not a physician, but they were uh, of, uh, very severe. Police also tell us the accused abuser is a 13-year-old boy. He's now facing a second-degree child abuse and neglect charge. Anytime someone is burned, that's obviously a severe crime. What's uh, unique about this one is the age of the offender, and uh, that's uh, something we, you know, hope to prevent in the future. And uh, this, this individual could get some uh, treatment to determine why he actually did this. We've learned two adults, Jay and Kimberly Taylor, are also being charged with second degree child abuse and child neglect. Police say they were at the Grand Avenue home when the crime happened and allegedly failed to stop it or report it. The 13 year old and both adults are scheduled to be arraigned in family court tomorrow. Reporting live in Pawtucket with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.